When I'm lounging around my house, I have so many entertainment options. I can watch TV. I can play video games. I can spend hours on social media alone. I can text or call my friends. I could spend my entire afternoon surrounded by technology. Or I could read. Technology is great, but there's just something unique about flipping through the pages of a good book. That's why I believe in reading. I'm not talking about reading books and textbooks assigned in classrooms, although those are important. I'm talking about reading that makes time speed up and the world dissolve around you. I'm talking about reading that's dangerous to do when you've got a pile of work nearby. It's reading that makes your heart race while you flip through the pages and makes your heart throb with pain when you reach the final sentence. It's the type of reading that makes you feel. I'm primarily a fantasy reader. If a book has magic in it, then I probably read it or plan to read it soon. I've read the Lord of the Rings series ten times, and each time I find something new that I love. The characters in Game of Thrones, The Wheel of Time, Swan Song, and Harry Potter aren't just words on a page. When I read, they become flesh and blood in my mind, and when I finish any book in the series, I feel as if I've just said goodbye to a group of my dearest friends. But that's just me, a die-hard fantasy nerd. My advice to everyone else is to read whatever reaches your head and your heart. It doesn't matter if it's creative nonfiction greats like Joan Didion, Maya Angelou, and David Sedaris. It could be religious texts or biographies. It might even be romance novels or historical fiction. TV and movies tell you what to think and imagine. Books let your mind do the work, and they can take you to places that you could never reach any other way. I don't know why some people have stopped reading for fun. Maybe reading requires too much concentration in a world where multitasking is the norm. Maybe TV and movies are more alluring or just easier on the mind. When you think about it, the use of a mere 26 letters in the alphabet has the ability to make you laugh, cry, scream, and believe. That's something that a TV screen, a smartphone, a video game console, and a laptop will never be able to do. Thank you.